going to be sharing with you in this video some projects that I created recently for the Paratext UK design team, which I'm a part of. Uh, this month I got the Secret Art Box, which is the new subscription box from Paratext UK. So I came up with some projects to inspire you with, so you're able to create some things with all the bits and pieces inside. This channel being the first one, where I used some of the textured paper, lace, I used some of my own fabric inside um, on the top there and then this plaster embellishment came as well I covered it with the blue power text that comes in the kit and then dry brushed it with the acrylics and pearl pigments that are also in the kit so if you happen to have any um, <clears throat> papers in your stash then what you can do is use those papers to cover the inside of your book. I've just used a, an old book that I had um, and pulled all the insides out and then I've created my own insides basically for it in the pages and I've stuck these down with the um, Easy Coat Matte which is a decoupage glue by Paratex UK and um, it's my favourite because there's a matte finish to it but also leaves a, a small amount of texture I don't know if that actually picks up on the page the other thing I like about that is that you can take any rice paper and then add it to a page so this rice paper I'll just show you here this is the rice paper I got in the box um, and once you put the glue on it becomes translucent on the page so I'll show you all the pages the pages I created with Vista which is another Powertex product which is a walnut stain and I just dip the papers or spray the papers with the Vista so I've added more of the rice paper to these pages and you can use anything for your pages and you can stamp them however you like I've also created a tag and that's also got some of the rice paper on there as well um, and just continue through you can put lots of pages in this one so again put some more rice paper on that one there and this image here too that's from the rice paper And more of the owls and then there's another tag in here some more rice paper pasted on the page another tag and that's the inside and the back of the journal all the way through the other piece that I created is this little bird shape and I just thought I would just show you on here how I've done it as well. The full instructions can be seen on the blog. And then the other piece I created was this frame. So I hope you've enjoyed seeing these in the video um, and do pop over to the blog on Powertex UK to have a look on how to create these pieces. Thanks all, bye!